Pastor Debbie's exceptional uh, as a pastor because she is such a friend to everyone. I don't know if her eagerness drives her energy or if her energy drives her eagerness, but she just seems to be every place all the time doing everything. My daughter had type 1 diabetes, which is a very destructive disease, and it eventually caught up with her. She was in the hospital. Pastor Debbie came and spent an inordinate amount of time with us. She prayed with us. She listened to all of our stories, and she was just there. She was tireless while they were working on my daughter. The fact that she is so genuinely caring and reaches out to so many people in a lot of ways, um, I just think she has a lot of love and she shares that and she doesn't let anybody go past her but what she tries to touch their life. She's very genuine that way and I know that, you know, for me, she was a real blessing with being a, a she still is a prayer partner with me and I really appreciate that. She exemplifies Christ-like love for all people. She never meets a, an enemy. She never meets someone uh, that's a stranger. She gets to know people, her neighbors, her church members, uh, her uh, work, people at work and, and classmates and anybody that's in her life. She takes time for them. Uh, we had some issues in the church and some, divi and some divisions. And Debbie was right there. She's willing to talk about the elephant in the room, so to speak. And she's coming to people and saying, come, let us reason together. And she's very good at uh, constructing the conversation so it doesn't get around to condemnation, but rather to uh, constructive. How can we make this better and what can we do? And she just always goes out of her way to make people feel warm and welcome and loved. And she does it in such a gentle and kind way that makes just everyone feel like she's genuinely in their lives. And that's exactly how she is. She has a good grasp on what's needed. And what is needed is people who have empathy for one another and who are willing to put themselves out. You've heard a couple of other stories from folks who have testified, you might say, today about her abilities and her caring and willingness to share what she has and who she is with the others. And we need more of that, not less.